I'm at the gym this morning because I'm going to be doing a class, but I've arrived at 30 minutes early. So I'm just going to be on the treadmill up until when the class starts. I'm very into it at the moment. This whole idea of like if you're doing something physical, trying to do something like mental at the same time, which I've phrased that poorly. There's like a better saying for it. I've heard it on like podcasts and stuff. Yeah, so it's like if you're cleaning the house, you can listen to a podcast or something like that. Um, so whilst I'm on the treadmill, instead of what I would normally do is just like scroll TikTok or Instagram or something, I've got my book and I'm going to read my book. Obviously, you couldn't do this if you were like running because that would be dangerous, but I'm just walking and I feel comfortable walking and reading a book. Just did the gym class and I was the only one in it, so that's always good. It's basically just a free training session. Just me and the trainer. On Fridays, I just can't be bothered to wear like mascara, so I just do a little bit of face stuff to just like make myself like look more awake, but just don't bother with mascara because I've worn it Monday to Thursday. I just want a day off from it. I'm just going for a little walk on my lunch break. It's good to get some sun and like stretch my eyes. And by stretching my eyes, I mean like look at things like in, further away in a distance because I've spent hours looking at a very close computer. Like I always make sure I do that. Um, I was hearing like really loud car noises and I was like, wait, what is going on? And then I realized that it's Gold Coast 500 this weekend, which if you've never heard of it, it's like a car race. I don't know. I've really no, never been like to it or like seen it or anything, but it happens every year. So yeah, that's going on in surface right now and the cars are very loud. Just in Coles right now, grabbing some bits that are on sale and then I'm gonna do the rest of my grocery shopping at Woolies. Later though, obviously, because I don't have enough time to do my full grocery shop in my lunch break. So I was just walking through the shopping center and I passed Valley Girl and I saw this skirt in the window and I had to come try it on. Look how cute that is. It's all sequins. That is, like, this is a stunning skirt. It's probably a little, like a tiny, tiny bit shorter than what I normally like to wear, but not too short for me. Um, and it's only $35, like, amazing. Just spending the last 40 minutes of my work day on the walking pad. Um, I love this, it's so good for getting just some extra steps in for the day. So my hairdresser recommended that I get this. It's called Milkshake Integrity. I bought the intensive treatment, the shampoo, the conditioner, and the leave-in conditioner. I very much trust his recommendation because he doesn't get any like kickback for recommending this. He's like, this is just purely like my opinion. This would be good for your hair. So I ordered it online and I actually got it it was like already like 20% off and then I also got another 20% back through Shopback. So I actually got it at like a pretty good price. So it says to put on damp hair. So I'm just going to put it on my hair and then leave the mask in overnight and wash it in the morning. I um, went to Woolworths after work and did my grocery shopping for the week. But I made the fatal mistake of going to one that I don't normally go to. So I was so lost looking for everything around the store. Like I think it's just best to go to the ones that you know well. Because I do feel like it took me longer to do the grocery shop. Um, so yeah, that was annoying. Also, I almost always, usually go on like a Saturday or Sunday morning because I go with my dad um but he's away this weekend so I was just like oh I'll just get it done like tonight because I don't have any plans on my Friday but um I do think it actually is better going in those early mornings because like all the shelves are freshly stocked like it's all new stock and like there's plenty of everything whereas like tonight I could definitely tell like 
I didn't get some of the meats I wanted to get because they'd run out. I wanted to get like Coke Zero's or like the home brand version of like Coke Zero. And um, they had sold out of those as well. So yeah, I do think I'll revert back to, well, I'll just keep sticking with the early mornings because they definitely work best. <laughs> Okay, so I just arrived to the library. I love coming to the library so I can just like focus on things that I want to get done. So I've got my to-do list as always. So on the to-do list is I want to do my Duolingo for the day. I want to do proper French study. Um, I was doing some yesterday after work actually. And what I found really effective, and I've always known this, but like this is what I used to do when I was back at uni, but not just like reading the book, but actually like writing down and making notes as like I'm going along. Um, I felt like it was, I was absorbing it more. So I'm going to keep up with doing that. Um, I need to research health insurance because I need to get some health insurance. I was originally looking at getting hospital and extras, but honestly, it's pretty expensive. And so I don't think I need extras as much like I was just thinking about it and I think for the moment I'm good with just getting hospital cover so I want to look into um, how different places compare just for hospital cover I have a wedding coming up that I need to order some dresses for to try on yeah so that's everything that I want to get done at the library I also need to just speak to the librarians because I think the Gold Coast library system has just had a re complete refresh and you have to um, create a new password or something. I was trying to do it online and it wasn't working for me. So I need to speak to them about that. And then after the library, I want to pop in to an op shop because I'm looking for bits at the moment to kind of personalize my work office at work. So I want to look for things like a pen cup. I want to get a lamp. I originally got these two from Kmart, but I decided that I wanted something more like unique and I thought it would be cool like looking at an op shop, seeing what they've got and it's ob obviously better for the environment to buy something that's, you know, already been used and I might find something a bit different. It's probably going to be at a good price. So yeah, that's the plan. Okay, so I've come to this lifeline here at Mermaid, which from memory, I think this is a very good op shop. But I've just seen as well that there's a Salvo's store over there, which I've never seen before. I feel like it must be new. Um, so we'll go check out that one afterwards as well. So I'm particularly looking in the homeware section. Because that's where I might find some things for my office. Okay, that's something potentially I could use as my pen cup. It's only a dollar. It's pretty, like it's a bit bigger than what I was thinking. But I'm, I'm liking that potential. It's another bucket type thing. But I think that's a little too bright pink for me. Okay, didn't get anything at either of them. Um, I feel like I just really need a feeler. Like I really want to make my office really nice and like style it completely how I want. So if I don't find something I'm not in love with, like it's fine. I don't desperately need certain things. I'm happy to just wait and spend the time and then find things I really like. I'm going to a Halloween party tonight. Um, it's like my friend is hosting, like it's not like at an official, it's not like an official event or location thing. Um, so I'm excited because I didn't do, actually do anything for Halloween last year. I, I've definitely changed as I've gotten older because the old me would have been preparing a costume for weeks. Whereas current me is just like, you know what? I've got a costume drawer, a small drawer, 
and I'm just gonna refer to that and grab um, something from there that's what I'm happy with but tonight is basically gonna be like a free night for me because I haven't bought a costume I'm just using something I already have it's at my friend's house and she lives like two streets away so I don't need to pay for like an uber or anything and then in terms of alcohol I already have like a bottle of vodka it's probably quite a few years old to be honest with you but it's just been sitting in my room I feel like liquor is fine like it doesn't have an expiry date so yeah I'm just gonna drink that and I've got just like some lemonade that I can mix with it so yeah basically nothing needs to be spent tonight having a big bowl of pasta before heading out Yum. and we have our costume for the night I'm pretty happy with this Hello. <laughs> wow. Okay, so we've just arrived to Ravina Town Centre. We're gonna go to the Village Markets, which is the market that used to be at Burley Primary School. They've now moved to Ravina. So we'll do that and then just have a bit of a walk around Ravina, look in Apple Store, go to Kmart, etc. Just in charcoal clothing right now, trying on some clothes. How cute is this dress? I'm not sure if I'm going to get it right now, but I'm definitely going to think about it and make sure that I really want it, but it is very cute. Okay, so it turns out that the village markets are not every Sunday. I don't know how I got that wrong. I was convinced that they were. So um, we're just going to look around Ravina. The Christmas decorations are up. total chill I need to have my chill time before I start back at work next week so I'm gonna have a nice shower get comfy in my comfortable in my pajamas and then I think I'm gonna do a face mask I literally have like a roulette of different face masks that I brought back from the UK because before I left I managed to get heaps of them on sale these are all from Primark I'm thinking today I'm gonna to go with the purifying one because I feel like I have quite a few spots that are waiting to come out. So hopefully purifying will just bring everything out and then leave my face looking nice and fresh. Dinner tonight. And then we've also got some homemade fries slash wedges in the air fryer. 